husband George and I visited Sitges and Barcelona back in July. It was my first time going and I had a blast, but George has been there many times with his family. He's Cuban American, but his ancestry is Spanish. I lived in Sitges for three years until I was five years old. Tisa and I joined my family at one of our favorite restaurants, La Nanza. La Nanza is a special place for us as it's been open almost 60 years now and my family has known the owners Mireya and Anton since they were kids. It's a lovely little restaurant and their food is of the highest quality. In addition to the traditional dishes that you would find at most restaurants in this region, they make a seafood soup that's amazing. It wasn't on the menu the evening we visited, but they made it for my mom, not this evening. I had a fish called Corvina, which is similar in texture to Mediterranean sea bass or Branzino, and it was delicious. A couple of other items that we had a chance to eat during our trip to Siches is the Rodaballo uh, fish, that's a uh, turbot in English. It's a flat fish, it's a very ugly fish, but boy was it tasty, um, as you can see in the photo here. We had that fish at a restaurant called La Marinada in Siches, and uh, it was probably one of the best restaurants we ate at while we were there. Everything we ate was fantastic. The other item to point out was uh, it's it's they call it, it's a tree of sausages. It's it's brought out and you, they hang all these different sausages there and they hand you a knife and you can slice up the sausages and eat. Uh, it's kind of their uh, their equivalent of bringing out chips and salsa. So you can have as much of the sausage as you want, different kinds of sausages, chorizos, all kinds of different uh, interesting sausages there before uh, the meal comes out. And that was in a restaurant called La Masia, also in Siches. Okay, we're here in one of the street corners at, in Siches, near the apartment where we're staying at. Um, this is, uh, just wanted to point out, this is the school where I went to kindergarten many years ago. Uh, it's a public school. And then here's the uh, steps I remember going up for a class. I think the classroom was up those steps here. Here's a side view of the uh, school and the steps that uh, we used to go up to class. And then this is, uh, it's on a corner, so here's the other street that it's on. I'm gonna show you the, uh, the courtyard where all the kids play. I think they've got summer school going on right now. That's so nice, a nice little courtyard and let's see. Yeah, there we go. So here's the rest of the school, courtyard, kids for to play. So it's good memories. We're here at a bakery called Four Nine in Sicha, Spain. And we come here every morning for a pastry and coffee. Um, just to start our day. Um, and they do have free Wi-Fi, so that's another good reason to come. Um, outside of the food, we didn't get. Um, after this, we are headed to the train station to go to Barcelona. <laughs> This is a very famous street that goes down to the port of Barcelona called La Rumba. It used to be a, this used to be a river and they paved it and hundreds of years, hundreds of years ago, years ago, and now it's called La Rumba. We're about to go into Zara. They have a lot of sales, so let's go check them out. This is 
We're about to eat at this restaurant. Um, we're gonna have some tapas. We're having lunch in Barcelona. Tapas. What kind of tapas are these? These are the piquito peppers that uh, we can get in the States. Um, that's uh, like a lentil soup. And that's a uh, garbanzo or chickpea soup with, uh, with pork. This is a very traditional octopus dish. It's served uh, sliced with some seasoning and served over uh, uh, thin slices of potato. And finally, we finish off our lunch with some uh, crema catalan, which is uh, very similar to creme brulee. And finally, no good Cuban finishes their meal without a cup of uh, espresso. Mine's uh, called a uh, cortadito, which means it has a little bit of milk in it uh, and some sugar, of course. El arroz cal caldoso, ¿Tienes es rico, sí. es muy bueno. Es que tenemos, sí. Como calidad es mejor que hay. Perfecto. Es ¿Ya estamos? Listo. Muy bien. Muchas gracias. Gracias.